Afghanistan's second biggest city, Kandahar, has fallen to the Taliban in a significant blow for the government forces there. Kandahar is a traditional stronghold for the militant group and a key economic hub. A spokesman for the Taliban said on Friday they had captured three other cities, including the capital of Helmand province. They now control most of northern Afghanistan and about a third of the country's regional capitals. In response to the Taliban's swift advances, the Pentagon announced it was sending 3,000 extra troops in to help evacuate U.S. embassy staff. Britain is also deploying troops to help bring its nationals home, as the U.K. defence minister warns the country is spiralling towards a failed state that could become a breeding ground for al-Qaeda. The speed of the offensive has sparked recriminations among many Afghans over President Joe Biden's decision to withdraw from the conflict. Biden said this week that he did not regret his decision, noting Washington has spent more than $1 trillion on the war and lost thousands of troops. A US intelligence assessment this week said the Taliban could isolate Kabul within 30 days and take it over in 90. The United Nations has warned that if their offensive does reach the capital, it would have a catastrophic impact on civilians.